This is my impersonation of every elementary school teacher ever. Detective Ted. <laughs> of Melanie Choice and Mark Chambers. It was a mystery at Edward's house. <laughs> Not even turning the page. <laughs> the best of the best from my heart on my chest so the <laughs> 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 words <laughs> Brandon, what are we what? doing today buddy oh, we're walking to red cliffs mall what are we doing at the mall friend uh we're gonna go inside barnes and noble and we're gonna we're gonna taste some books. I mean, like, read them and that's how you taste them. Crusty pages. We're gonna read one line. We're gonna flip to a random page of random books and flip to a random line within and then rate that book from a scale of one to 10 on how much we'd want to read the rest of it. Exactly. In a Supreme shirt don't mean I think I'm better than y'all. My sister got this for $5 in China. Didn't know it was, didn't know it was a, a, a Gucci brand. <laughs> I don't know. Dude, Overwatch, yes! It's a noble, I can't believe we made it. I know, isn't it wild? <laughs> be our first sample. Stephen King's The Outsider. I heard this was his newest book. I've heard this one's got a clown in it. No, not this one. Oh, okay. Shut up, Jeannie said. She kept her voice low, but they all heard the anger in it. Give her a chance. What would you rate that book? How much do you want to read it? I'll give it a seven. seven. It's, it's like a good. solid lukewarm. It's all lukewarm. So as the resident Tourette's patient, I think Don't Bull Shank Yourself is the, the, the ideal book for me to choose first because of profanities. Compulsive damaging behaviors are found in people from every demographic and in all industries. So CD, I'm gonna rate this a zero out of 10 because it's too close to home. He looks like he, oh, he's a cake boss. <laughs> Yo, he looks almost like, what's his name? Uh, Gilbert Godfrey. He's, he looks like Gilbert Godfrey. <laughs> Bull Yourself. Did you know that she's delicate? What do you call something you eat that uh, makes you makes you not tell lies? The truthful carrot. It's a truth witch. Oh, how could I have been so stupid? <laughs> this book just copied Stranger Things. <laughs> Which Heather Graham, pale as death. <clears throat> there are a lot of maybes, but I think we have more than a maybe here. Maggie McAvoy. Yeah, uh, scale one to ten. Uh, two. Not enough juice factor. Two for poo. Two for poo and three for pee. And four for you and five for me. Oh, this one ain't a book, it got pictures in it. Oh, there's my finger in the book. camera. Oh, <laughs> shot. Oh, shoot. It'd be a terrible elementary teacher. <laughs> Story time with Tanner. You don't have to be the best at everything. You can decide to do something just because it's fun, or because someone you love likes to do it, or because you want to. <laughs> What'd you rate that ten one? 10 out of 10. <laughs> I think we're sold just on the title alone. Yeah, we don't girl. need to open this book. We're buying it all. Uh, don't take this with me. <laughs> I need to find it. My finger's having Tourette's. There it is, the Tourette's fingers. <laughs> I've had enough of this feminist agenda. Boring, 2 out of 10. Unless you like roses. Dude, this is weird. Oh, uh, yeah. My head snapped up as our carriage bumped over a rock in the road. Connor, sitting in the seat directly opposite me, watched me in obvious disgust. Also, Paramount needs to get their crap together and make this into a movie and cast me as the lead. This, what the? This is weird. This is hauntingly accurate. Yeah! This is Stephen King's Doctor Sleep. It's the sequel to The Shining. Let's see if it holds up. Is it the sequel to Doctor Strange? No. Okay. He must never have gotten the shot. We have to tell Rose. We have to. And then it ends. Cliffhanger. Eight out of ten. <laughs> the best acoustic rock songs ever. Hey. Oh, this is, I know this song. <laughs> of course you do, you turd. It's a, if I took those words away. Commit. You Belt, it. Belt it. Belt it. Bang your Studios are vegan. Story time today is called A Tiger Called Thomas. When he and his family moved to a new house on a new street. Yeah. I didn't want to do it. I couldn't do it. 
I need to learn this so much. Okay. I don't understand. There's a page missing. Something's wrong here. Can you not, please? Hey, Mom. What's up, Mom? I'm not at the Barnes Noble Kids section. What you think? What? It's you, man. They made they made one of you. The Everything Big Book of Jokes. This essay is identical to the essay your brother handed in last year, the teacher tells the student. Well, of course it is, the student replies. We share the dog. That was a <laughs> when you live with when you live with Tanner Gilman. Get it? Because of Tourette's. Do you get it? Do you get Brennan, what happens when Pac-Man and Mrs. Pac-Man have a baby? I don't know, Tanner, what? You gave the pack son. <laughs> oh. A pleasure. For what it's worth, I've never kissed anyone while on assignment to tell you. Obviously, I can't break my own creed about keeping my personal life wired tight, then chastise you for doing the same. Saucy. They used my likeness without my permission. That's me, dude. What's up with that, man? They asked me, and I said, okay. You're beautiful. Yeah,